A general manager at Chinese oil giant Sinopec has been demoted following a luxury drink scandal at the firm's Guangdong branch. Company officials say he was found to have spent thousands of U.S. dollars of the company money on buying the drinks for his own personal use. China Report has more. Receipts leaked online showed that Sano Pax Guangdong branch spent nearly 400,000 U.S. dollars on three batches of expensive alcohol since 2010. The booths included Mao Tai, one of the most famous and expensive liquor brands in China, and imported wine. Coming at a time of rising fuel prices and general rising inflation, the disclosure of the receipts provoked public outrage. Sinopec at first said the alcohol was a commodity purchase and had been resold to liquor stores. Now on Monday, it revealed General Manager Lu Guangyu had been demoted in the wake of the scandal, bringing a new twist to the affair. The Guangdong branch also ordered Lu to pay $20,100 for the liquor he had consumed. Sinopec Chairman Fu Chengyu said the scandal had damaged Sinopec's image and hurt his business. He said Lu should be held directly responsible for the loss. After the alcohol bills were posted online this month, Sinopec twice sent investigation teams to Guangdong. Sources within the company contested reports that put the sum of Lu's alcohol expenditures at $400,000. They said he had in fact spent closer to $240,000 million on booze. According to our investigation, Lu consumed a large amount of alcohol that could be bought for a fairly low price. And Lu did not explain how he made use of 15 bottles of expensive imported wine. Ba He said that one thing had become clear. Lu bought such a large amount of alcohol for personal consumption. An expert said the scandal resulted from the fact that too much power was in the hands of top leaders of the state-owned giants. All the big events and financial decision makings were dominated by one person, the top leader. Thus, lack of supervision and over-concentration of power will lead to the failure of controls inside the company. Many Chinese web users expressed disapproval at the punishment meted out to Lu, saying a demotion was too lenient for the former general manager. They said Lu should have been fired.